We're here at the Incubator Lab studios um, in downtown Windsor, Ontario, and I've invited the public to come and participate in making their own bio art works and petri dishes in the same way that I make my own artwork. My artwork is a lot about the perspectives and lenses of newcomers, immigrants and refugees. And so a lot of the work that I do is about this idea of belonging and place making um, and maybe belonging to more than one place and not belonging to more than one place. I really utilize a lot of traditional Palestinian foods or cultural foods in the works that I'm making. So by taking a lot of these um, foods and cultural objects as source material to make my artwork and putting them in petri dishes and documenting the growth and decay over time, I'm able to visualize and articulate a lot of these invisible experiences and make them visible through the use of science. Food, much like art and music in general, is almost this common denominator that transcends languages and cultures and different geographies. We're literally playing with cultures in the context of science, uh, but then also thinking about the larger context of culture in terms of um, identity, politics, um, history. One of the things that I really love doing, especially in spaces like the Incubator Lab, is demystifying science and making it accessible. For some of the people that engage in my workshops, sometimes it's their very first time participating in anything that's art science related or bio art in general. And other times there's people who are very seasoned artists or scientists and it just gives them an opportunity to try something new.